So uh, I thought it might be fun to just share a little bit about um, what, where I came from as far as what inspired me to start Destination Decluttered uh, Life Coaching and Clutter Coaching. And I'm just offering this because I was decluttering my, uh, my office right here. I was moving around some books that I have found inspirational and I came across this old timey book right here which I feel like was almost my first like self-help book. And the funny thing is about this one is that literally um, I was inspired to find a copy of it by Phyllis Diller. I love Phyllis Diller. I have a picture of her. I was lucky enough to get an autographed copy of a picture of her before she passed because she to me exemplifies a woman who, you know, didn't even get started until she was in her 40s. And the, the Phyllis Diller we know flourished from her 40s until she passed well decades, decades, decades after that. And when she mentioned, I don't know, on YouTube or something, that this book called The Magic of Believing by Claude Bristow helped her, I said, well, if it's good enough for Phyllis, it's good enough for me. And I wrote, I read it, I wrote it, I love it. <laughs> And I really, I decided since it was mine, I would, I would highlight some stuff and put some post-it notes in it. And the cool thing is, is almost no matter where I look into it, there's something that says, yeah, it makes sense, you know? And even though it's written in old timey language, because it was, it started in like literally the one I have, let me see the copy I have first printed copyright 1948. So pretty old, but check this out. He says, take the initiative, always try to do something for the other fellow and you will be agreeably surprised how things come your way, how many pleasant things are done for you. Doing something for others always pays dividends in one dividends in one form or another. So I just want to offer to you is find inspiration wherever you can. Collect the inspiring things, the inspiring thoughts that mean something to you and use those to guide how you want to go from where you are in your life we're way over there, right there, where you are to where you want to be, okay? So it could be an old timey book mentioned by Phyllis Diller. It could be me, Beth, the decluttering life coach here on a video that is saying you deserve to live a life you love. So just, you know, start driving towards that, um, that road trip destination that you're so excited to get to. But whatever it is, really start to think about the things that mean something to you and inspire you to take positive action in the direction of your life, okay? Um, I'm gonna go put this back, actually a little, little sneaky thing. See back here in my background, there's this fun colored, I'm pointing at my screen, but it's right there, there. That's a little um, suitcase I used to use. I don't use it anymore because I have other luggage, but I keep my books in that because I wanted to keep the luggage. It reminds me of travel. Uh, so I store some of my books in a suitcase because you can be clever about where you uh, store the things that you want, okay? I hope that helps. I hope you have inspiration. Get inspired, take the action, do it. You got this, all right?